Hello everyone. Today I just do a very simple short video of a work I assign my student to do. So this is a modified adapted version from his or her work. So I was teaching GC O level physics and this student was very weak in the subject. She cannot remember definitions and cannot even remember equations well. So what I did was I asked her to do a graphic organizer in any format to kind of list out the definitions that she need to know in her syllabus as well as the equations. Okay, so um, this will be very helpful for students who need uh, to remember definitions and equation practically. Although I, I understand that the physics textbook at the back of it has a section on it. But it will be still useful for students to construct themselves because as they do it, they can remember better as their muscle is activated, which improves memory retention. So this is just a very simple sample where they will come up with all the definitions and equations. Definitions are very important in the physics O-level paper because there are many questions that require students to define followed by the subsequent questions. Equations uh, are needed for calculations. Confirm there will be questions that involve students to solve calculation problems. So equations are very helpful. So I actually arranged, or she arranged the chapters in order of the textbook, all right? So she listed out uh, topics from kinematics, dynamics, mass weight density, turning effect of forces, energy work power, pressure, temperature, kinetic model of metal, transfer of thermal energy, and thermal properties of metal. Uh, for her school, she will stop here for the end of the exam. So I also asked my student who is doing O-level this year to continue with this like what are all the equations and important definitions to remember that may come up for the examination wave static current of electricity dc circuit practical electricity has this very important equations it appear quite common uh, and lastly electromagnetism although this topic is taken out from the paper this year it will still be relevant for the cohort next year onwards so that's about it. It's a very simple activity. La. So students can use this opportunity to uh, refresh their memory of every topic they need to study. And hopefully by doing so, they can remember the equations better and be able to apply. We understand that questions are less straightforward now, but there are still some standard questions, okay, like definitions and simple calculations that help students to get some marks. La. So this is more for weak students uh, because these two, two students I have, one is not doing well, is failing a uh, two common tests and the other one also, uh, he, although he passed, he, he not getting, he's not getting a grade better than B4. Yeah, so that's about it. But I hope this will be helpful. Thank you.